welcome back to the weekly vlog well we're starting the weekly vlog on thursday um i haven't really done much this week i have just been i went to the bank three days in a row monday tuesday wednesday trying to get my national education number i'm just trying to get like admin nigerian stuff out of the way but um i'm flying back to the u.s tomorrow yay so excited so same to say i'm flying back home but home is such an interesting word anyways flying back to the u.s tomorrow i'm flying out of lagos since i live in abuja i'm actually going to what's going on with the light i'm actually going to fly to lagos today um with my mom so i fly to that 4 p.m so yeah today's my last day in this house i've been here almost two weeks it was okay anyways uh, we're gonna do that and the plan um pending lagos traffic and stuff is to go to some stores tomorrow i don't know how feasible it will be clearly it should be feasible but i heard they locked or they closed down one of the bridges that links the island to the mainland and it might be a whole hassle but we'll see anyways if we're going to go to the air actually i'm going to get my covid test first and then head to the airport It's supposed to be at 1, they move it to 4, hopefully it takes about 4, it's 3.30. They haven't announced that it's here, so. Yeah, just chill here. Let me show you guys what it looks like. So, just got to the hotel right now, and before everything gets messed, I'm going to show you guys downstairs, but let me show you what the room looks like. So this is what you see when you walk in. There's like a closet space. This is like your vanity. Lovely mirror. They have this really cool thing. It's like this is, do not disturb. This is housekeeping. So cool. Just like touch the buttons. Yeah. Um, this is a suite, I believe, a junior suite. It has like a mini living room over here. And some art wall. There's not much of a view, I don't think. Yeah, someone's back here. And then the bathroom. So we have this lovely, lovely tub. I love all the like under cabinet lights. Looks like this. With a shower and a toilet. That's sort of separate from the shower. So lovely. The bathroom is definitely my favorite. And then the bedroom. So king size bed. So gorgeous. The finishings are so lovely. I see that. The bed finishing is a nice little nook over here and like a reading table, a TV of course and yeah and that is it not much of a view like that is oh you see the sun setting that is cool but yeah that's it that's exactly what I wanted Like a chill sign, and I think the restaurant as well, and the pool. So let's see. The sun is setting, so it looks so gorgeous right now. I'll show you. I guess the lower ground is parking. So 
this is, I guess, the Mason area for the elevator. All the lights and motion sensors, I think they go up too quickly. That's my problem. Yep. Everything is nice and new. Alright, so today has been quite an interesting day. I haven't achieved anything I need to achieve and I'm leaving today. But I want to show you guys quickly what downstairs looks like. It's absolutely gorgeous. And then I'm going to head to the airport in like 45 minutes.
All right, so I just landed in Atlanta. It is currently 6, 10 a.m. I landed at like 5.25. And through security, through my boarding, and through like connecting to New York. And I have four hours to kill before my flight. Ah, there's an option to walk and there's an option to take the train. And since I have time, I'm actually quite energized. I'm gonna walk, get in my steps. So that's what we're gonna do. I don't know how long it's gonna take, but let's get to it. Print reminds me of the Gaia print, like the Kai Collective print. Anyways, I just made it to Terminal B. The walk was about 40 minutes. It's 10 to 7 right now. Um, amazing way to kill time. Um, the lounge in Terminal B was open before 7, so I just came to the lounge. I'll show you guys what this looks like before I leave. Um, but now I'm just gonna try to get on top of my emails and get some stuff sent off. I also grabbed some breakfast. I leave, so I'm good to focus on work for an hour and then breakfast, tour of the lounge really quickly, and yeah.
mountain. They allowed me back in the country, y'all. They allowed my ass back in this country. I'm in my apartment. <laughs> Anyways, I just got back. I've been away for two weeks. A friend of mine was supposed to come and check out my pants, but couldn't make it, and I was so scared that they were going to die. Do you guys remember the nursery I was starting? Unbelievable. So these are my plants, guys. What? This is so crazy. Like they are all growing, all of them. This cilantro is falling my hand. My mint falling my hand. My lavender, but everything else. I got some, I think I mixed them up because that looks like mint. <laughs> but, oh, this smells so good. Some basil in here, some parsley. I got some Thai basil. Oh, so excited. I need to water the other plant though. Like that piece over here. But this one, unfortunately, she died. My Thai basil. I think we can revive her even after like all this maybe she was overwatered. Even after all this water she died. Let's see if she'll come back to life. I'm just gonna pull her out of the water. This plant is just flourishing. Oh my other Thai basil. Oh my plants are doing so well. So well. I need to water them right now. Oh you guys, this plant is just shooting up. Everything looks so good. Yeah, I'm so happy. So happy. I'm gonna unpack right now. My apartment is for the most part clean. I just didn't fold laundry before I left. Yeah, so I need to tackle that. Tackle that, unpack. Get a COVID test, what are my plants, shower, and then put my back, my behind the couch. We are back home, we are back home, we are back home. Anyways. I think it's Ada, Ama, Eva Ada or Ada's Supper Club. It's like a dinner thing in New York where they serve like four course meals. I think they do this every two weeks on Saturday specifically. So I'm going to show you guys what that looks like. Um, but yeah, nothing much. Oh, my phone fell in between like the, between like the window and my chair. And when I was trying to get it, I held off my skin, guys. It hurts so much, and it's just like the very top layer. You can still see like the grooves in my, like the patch. I just hope it doesn't scar. I'm gonna cover it with a plaster because anything that touches it, cream, water, hand sanitizer. Anyways, but yeah. And then I got packages, so <laughs> those will have to be tackled tomorrow. I just need to pick them up before they send them back. So let me show you guys a couple of things. So that whole stack of packages and then this stack of packages. But yeah, it's not dinner time yet. Dinner time is in about 30 minutes. So I will disappear for now and then come back and show you guys dinner. When I'm having dinner, I just got my wine delivered. So when that cools a little bit, I will have a glass. White wine. Oh, I don't know why I just blanked. I'll have a glass of white wine and then have dinner like 30 minutes to an hour after. But yeah, um, I look so cute. I think my skin is back to behaving. This thing that was stressing me out is gone. I got some fashion for you guys, guys. Goodness. 
ordered some stuff from like the insurance brand. So excited to show you guys. Let me show you guys a sneak. Just a, a little something, something. So you guys know what we're working with. So. So like this. You guys, can you see the colors? But I'm excited. This whole rack from Nigerian brands and I have and I have a couple more things um, coming in this week that I couldn't pick up before I left so I'm excited okay I'm gonna go now <laughs> one thing I forgot to say guys I actually got like sausage roll some chicken pie and some meat pie <laughs> excited I mean it went into but yeah yeah, usually they'll have see stuff for me. Oh, and I got this too as well. So if you know, you know. If you know, you know. Oh my god. But um, yeah, I just said I had snacks. I didn't lie or anything, and they didn't check me. Excited. I'm about to eat this. Eat this. Ah! Do you guys know what sausage roll is? How do you guys eat sausage roll when you eat it? I usually like um, roll it and then eat the sausage first and then eat the dough my mom called me like she called me weird for doing this but i just like it separately like i like the flavor of the dough on the sausage but i don't like to eat it together i don't know if that makes sense my battery's gonna die cow I'm gonna 
have the veggies. I think they were like brined or had some vinegar and salt in them. That's really nice. And then. So, if you guys saw the first course, the appetizer was the falafel with some edible flowers and some spring greens. I've never had falafel before, so I don't have a base. Um, it was okay. I thought it could use a little bit more seasoning, and I thought it was super healthy, which is not a bad thing. It's just green. <laughs> I don't like particularly green foods unless I'm eating a salad. But it was okay. Could have used a bit more seasoning. Again, they change the meals every two weeks, so this is just based on my experience of this particular box. Um, the main meal was um, some Escovitch fish. I think this box is Caribbean. I don't know. Based um, Escovitch fish with some rice and beans and uh, what else was it? But oh, the vegetables, the pickled peppers. I really liked. I really like the pickled peppers. Really seasoned them well, and they had some coleslaw. I would have liked some sauce to go all of this. There was some pepper sauce, it was really really hot, but like I'll have like something to balance it. The fish was okay, nothing too spectacular, but overall, not bad. Um, the desserts, I actually didn't eat the dessert yet. I don't like peach, and the thing is peach cobbler. So if I do eventually eat that throughout the the week, I'll like share it in the next vlog. But overall, okay. It was 60 bucks for, I um, said 60, yeah, 60 dollars, 60 bucks. <laughs> 60 dollars for the whole experience. My favorite part of the whole thing was with the drinks. So they give you like two small bottles, which like give you two glasses. The drinks were phenomenal. Really, really enjoyed that. I think it was a mix of like pineapple, grenadine syrup. I added two shots of, a double shot of vodka. And um, I really enjoyed it. I really, really loved the drinks. But overall, okay experience. Um, I really like the thought behind it, like bringing the three course meal to your apartment. I like the initiative supporting black and female chefs. Uh, I think the food could have been better, but yeah, it was good so far. Before I like leave my overall experience, I think I'm, with, I'm going to give it one more try with a different chef and see what it's like but well, this is my initial experience but that is the end of this vlog i hope you guys enjoyed it i'm not really sure where this vlog started i think we started in nigeria and we ended up in new york but uh hope you enjoyed it till next vlog 